In this tutorial we're going to show you how to use an iPad as an outboard signal processor, processing three sets of analog signals and then sending them back to the door. We're going to send microphone, guitar and synthesizer via the iConnect Audio 4 Plus into the iPad and then back to the door where we're going to record the results of the processed analog inputs as separate tracks. We need to change some routing in iConfig to do this. First notice that the default is that the analog inputs are routed to USB 1 and USB 2. But in this case we don't want that. We only want to send the inputs to USB 2, which is the iPad. So we'll remove the routing to the Mac. Next we'll set up the output routing from the iPad back to the Mac. Although we only have four analog input channels, we're going to send the mic and the guitar into stereo effects on the iPad, so we're going to record six channels of output in stereo pairs. And now we'll remove all the other routing apart from the output from the door. That leaves us with the door output still going to the analog mixer, and the analog mixer is then sending to the analog outputs. Now we need to set up the iPad. I've started Audio Bus and set up three lanes. I'm going to connect the inputs to each of the three lanes, starting with the mic in channel 1, the guitar in channel 2, and the stereo synth on channels 3 and 4. Now I'm sending each analog input into a different effect, and then the result of each effect to the MyMix application. I'm using MyMix because Audio Bus can only currently send to a single stereo output channel and I want to keep the output separate and record them separately in the door. So in my mix, I've panned the microphone left and assigned it to the output channels 1 and 2. I've panned the guitar right and assigned it to the output channels 3 and 4. And I've left the synthesizer pan center and sent it to channels 5 and 6. I've also adjusted the output levels for each track. In live, I have three stereo tracks, each of which is recording from one of the pairs we set up earlier in iConfig. One and two for the mic. Remember, the output from the iPad is a stereo effect. Three and four for the guitar, and five and six for the synthesizer. Now we can record mic, guitar, and synthesizer using our iPad as part of the signal chain to provide three different effects simultaneously and record the results into three separate tracks in the door, thanks to the iConnect Audio 4 Plus. Be sure to watch the rest of the videos in this series for more examples on patch bay routing and using the mixer and MIDI routing.